Hey guys, Lolo here. Today is January 14th, 2020, the day Windows 7 ends support. So since Windows 7 support ends today, I decided to compare Windows 7 to Windows 8.1 to Windows 10. I already did the, vi the video comparing Windows 7 starter to Home Basic, to Home Premium, and Professional to Ultimate, and I already covered up upgrade how upgrade from Windows 7 to Windows 10. So watch make sure you watch those videos then check this video out. So let's let's look at the start menus on all operating systems here. Windows 10 has a very cool start menu. Windows 8.1 has a start screen and Windows 7 has the very cool start menu. Look, look, look like Windows XP and Windows Vista. Windows 7, when it was released, it came with Internet Explorer 8 which was released in 2009 and is 2020. So I recommend that you don't use it. Yeah, but it can be updated to the latest Internet Explorer 11, which was released in 2013. Windows 8.1 comes in by default, has Internet Explorer, Windows Explorer, and Windows Store. Windows 10 by default, it comes with Microsoft Edge, File Explorer, Microsoft Store, and Mail. Windows 7 was the last version that they called this where Windows Explorer, this one they call it, since Windows 8 it is, was named File Explorer. Windows 7 by default it has Internet Explorer, Windows Explorer, and Windows Media Player pinned to the taskbar. So let's go ahead and look at the system specs. Windows 8 was the last version to have um, Windows Experience Index. So and Windows 7 was the last version to have Windows games. Windows 7 came out Windows 7 was released in October of 2009, Windows 8.1 was released in October of 2013, and Windows 10 was released in July of 2015.
Let's watch Internet Explorer 8 on Windows 7, Internet Explorer 11 on Windows 8.1, and Microsoft Edge on Windows 10. For some reason, Windows 10 is taking a long time. I don't know why, but wait, let's we'll see. Let's wait. The Windows 8 recycle bin is straight from Windows 7, or the recycle bin on Windows 10 is so brand spanking new. Alright guys, that was my video of comparing Windows 7 to Windows 8.1 to Windows 10. Now before I go, since, since Windows after today, Microsoft will no longer provide any more security updates or technical support for Windows 7. So, make sure you upgrade to Windows 8.1 or Windows 10. I do want to point out that Windows 8 support will end in January of 2023, meaning that in three years, you'll have to go through the entire upgrade process again. Windows 10, on the other hand, support will end in October of 2025. So that's all. Have a fantastic day, everyone. Bye.